Welcome to Carrie's Tutorials. I'm Simeon Grace. I'll be making a ruffle tool dress. It's a pink ball gown for a child of about four years and measurement varies so you need to get the half length and the full length. You also need the shoulder measurements and the round shoulder measurements as well as the waist measurements. Don't forget we upload our cutting and sewing tutorial separately. So if you're watching the cutting, you also need to watch the sewing tutorial as well. Leave your comments in the comment box below. And if this is your first time on this channel, kindly click the subscribe button. Click on the bell in order to get notification anytime we upload a new video. You can follow us on Facebook, Instagram, and on Twitter at All Africa TV. Follow me on Facebook and on Instagram at Kairi's Creations. So let's move to the cutting table. Alright, to start with, I'm going to start by gathering um, the base of the dress. Now, this is the ad net and the length of 8 inches. So, I have two of these. I'm going to join this together. Then I have another two. I'll join the two together as well. So, I'll gather this separately. I'll gather the other one separately as well. Then... Remember the one we cut, the 15, uh, 16 inches left, the 16 inches length. We cut two of these as well. So but I'm, going to cut, I'm going to gather this separately. So I'll gather the first one on its own. I'll gather the other one on its own. But the eight, the eight inches, I'm first going to join the two together. Then I'll, That means I have four of these. So I'll join two together. I'll gather. I'll join these two together. So that I'll have very long length and I'll gather it as well. So together, I'll pick one of my threads and I'll pull. So I'll pull to a point, then I'll continue on the other side. So I'll continue that. And the next thing, I'm going to join this together as well and I'll gather.
the next one All right, having done this, the next thing to gather is my veil net. All right, this is um, the other six inches veil net that I cut out. You can join everything together before gathering, but I'm going to just um, gather this. And it's going to be at the middle. I'm going to gather at the middle of the veil net, not at the edge. Okay, so I've got out of the veil net. The next thing I'm going to do, this is one of the two steps veil net, and this is going to be on the outer part. First, I'm going to join, I'm going to join this now, and after joining, at the base, I'll be attaching this to the base of the veil net. So for my joining, I'm going to measure seven inches for my zip um the zipper allowance so i'll leave seven inches so let's move on
so I guess we are done with this this is the first one the next thing I'm going to do I'll join my mercury as well and I'll leave my zipper space so I'll join the rest I'll do the same to the next veil net and the lining too okay I think we didn't cut out the lining in the previous um, video that we did so what I did here I have the length this is the length of my lining 18 inches and we used um, two yards so I have two yards so I'm going to join this together this is one and this is another I'll join it together the same 18 inches so I'll join it together as well then I'll gather the lining so I'll gather this separately I'll gather this separately so those are what we're going to do now next is to work on the hard net this is the length of 15 inches and this is the length of 8 inches i'm going to gather this as one of the 8 inches i'm going to gather it on the length of 15 inches in such a way that the length will be equal at the base okay so we are done with joining that now this is the other net which is the 15 inches so it's coming first then i'll place the step the next one on it followed by lining now we have to make sure the waist measurement is 28 inches after gathering the lining the net the 
you have to make sure it is 28 inches that's the measurement of the waist so this is coming on it to cover it now so i'm going to gather this and i'm going to join this together is to join the lining i'll pick the lining to join next is the hard net and the last one so i'll join it each of it i'll join it separately We have this now. A dress is coming up gradually. Got it. So we have this ready and we also have this. The next thing to do, I'm going to bring this. Yeah. Then I'll join this as well.
To work on the half length, first we need to cut out um, a strip of fabric and the length is going to be the 3 inches we subtracted from the cutting plus our seam allowance. So this will go for both the front and the back. So that's the length of 6 plus your seam allowance. Now to join, I'm going to measure from the middle. I'll measure 3 inches to the left and to the right to join to the front. So let's get to work. This is um, the width of about one and a half inches. So I'll just fold to join. All right, so this is the back now. I'm going to also bring this to join to the back. So we have to align this to join. I'll join to the back as well. Next is to hold the darts, so it's going to be 3 inches from the middle. This is a little girl, so I'm going to take just 3 inches. And the length is going to be 4 inches. Next is to bring out the shape so, and the waist measurement is 28 inches. I have 16, 28 divided by 2 is 14 inches. So I'm just going to hold 1 inch on both sides. Having done that, I'm going to bring the front lining. So I'm going to turn first. I will also do the same to the back.
So having done that, I'm going to turn the zipper space. I'm going to turn it in. Then I'll join the linings together. All right, the next thing I'm going to do is to turn the ham O. I'm going to turn the ham O, then I'll join it to the already made half length. So it's either we fix this, the sleeve first or we attach this to the half length first. So, but there is need to high on this before we work on the sleeve. To work on the sleeve, this is um, the lining. So I'm going to turn the base, the edge of, the, uh, of my mercury. Since it's a less edge I'll be using for the sleeve. So I'll only be turning the edge. So, having worked on the half length, we're going to join it to the already made um, base and we are left with fixing the zip. Don't forget to leave your comments in the comment box below. All right, so we're going to fix um, the last lining, which is going to cover the net. But this time around, I'm going to turn it so as to use it to cover all my sewing. So after this, I'll fix the zipper and that will be the end of our sewing. So you can just go ahead to add whatever design 
you feel like adding to your dress to give it the good sauce so if this is your first time on this channel click the subscribe button also click the bell to get notification each time we upload a new video So this is what the inside looks like. Mm. So we are going to fix the zip now.